Good morning. My name is Jada Watts with the YBF, and I have Carla Banks Waddles. How are you? Hi. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm great. Me too. That's good to hear. So, Bel Air has such a positive family dynamic. How was it like creating that dynamic and then watching it unfold on screen? I mean, just amazing. You know, it's an ensemble family, black family. Um, this cast is just so talented. You can give them anything and they'll take it and run with it. So it's just been a dream grow knowing that I grew up with this family and watching this family um, and just loving this family deeply and now being able to uh, bring them into a uh, the current times, 2023, it, it just feels like a dream creating for this ensemble. That's so cool. And they, each person in the family just has their own space, their own outlet and story to tell. So how is it finding that balance in the characters and then maintaining that? Yeah, you know, the writer's room spends a lot of time at the beginning of the season just talking about what is the journey? Like, where do we leave them in season one? And where do we want to start them in season two? And sort of what's the journey we want them to go on from beginning to, and we've got 10 episodes to send them on a journey, 10 episodes to tell a movie about the Banks family. And so we do that for every character. So on Viv, what does she want? What's she going to do? What's going to be the interesting stories for her and for Will and for Carlton? And not just them individually on their journeys, but just even... Um, interweaving the relationships, you know, we've got a marriage, <laughs> we've got parents, uh, we've got cousins. And um, so just really being able to look at the stories that people loved season one and the dynamics that people loved season one and the pairings and, um, and just sort of like what kind of journey can we put them on season two that feels fun, that feels relevant, that feels surprising, um, and just really um, a whole ride of a full season for each of them. Um, and just watching it unfold. Okay. Was there any specific moment or part in season two that really resonated and connected to who you are? Ooh, that's a good question. I feel like so much of this family, I connect to who they are. You know, I'm a mom, I'm a wife, I have teenagers. Um, so I think uh, so much of Aunt Viv and Will's story, um, you know, she has a soft spot for Will <laughs> and she just wants to take care of this young man. And she also has a soft spot for Carlton. And so just trying to be a mom that is sort of splitting your emotional bandwidth <laughs> with everybody and making sure that everybody feels taken care of. And so I think Aunt Viv for me, you know, is, is a very personal character um, because she tries to take care of everybody, but she's still trying to find her own space and carve out the things that are important to her while also taking care of everybody else. So um, I really just love her relationship to the family and how she is sort of a, a centering character for everybody. Yes, I love Anviv. <laughs> if you could put season two into one word, what would it be? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I, one word is tough. <laughs> I would say it's going to be revelatory. Okay. Revelatory. We're going to go deeper into a lot of these characters in ways that people will be like, oh, surprised, <laughs> um, um, but uh, in a good way. I think people will enjoy the wild ride. So yeah, revelatory. <laughs> All right. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Carla. And season two is going to be epic. Thank you. I can't wait for you to see the whole thing. Yes. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too.